Hello everyone, today I will be bringing you on a tour of Chris Hadfield's life. Chris Hadfield is a Canadian astronaut that commanded the ISS. We will start off with his early life. His parents' names are Eleanor and Roger Hadfield. Chris was born on August 29th. 1959 in Sarnia and raised in Milton, Ontario on a corn farm. Chris has two brothers, David and Philip. Chris, David, and Philip were cadets together. When Chris was nine years old, he watched Neil Armstrong walk on the moon. Ever since then, he dreamed of being the commander of a spaceship. Chris graduated in 1977 from Milton District High School. In 1982, he got his bachelor's degree in mechanical engineering with honors at the Royal Military College in Kingston, Ontario. We will now move on, on to the tour of Chris Hadfield's adult life. I hope you are enjoying the tour so far. Chris's first job was being a farm boy. He married Helena Walter to become Helena Hadfield. Together, they had three children who are now adults. Other, from, other than being an astronaut, Chris can gather a crowd. He even has a road and a school named after him. That's pretty cool, don't you think? He has had a very interesting life, don't you think? Shall we move on to a tour of his career? Chris was a US, test, U.S. Navy test pilot of the year and flew a, the first intercept Soviet bomber as a NORAD pilot in the times of the Cold War. Previous to his time on the ISS, he has had two other space expeditions. Chris spent five months on the ISS from December 2012 to May 2013. He, has, he was the commander of the ISS for his last two months. Did you know that he was the first Canadian to be, to be a commander of the ISS? I think that's pretty cool. Really honorable for our country. Creeper. He worked as capsule communi com communicator for both space shuttle and ISS expeditions. 
Now I'd like to share some other random facts about Chris Hadfield with you. So far, I think he's he's really done a lot. He's really interesting to me. On January 21st, 2013, Chris dropped the puck from the ISS for the ceremony of face-off of, for the Toronto Maple Leafs home opening game. Chris Hadfield has several interesting interests in life, including skiing, playing guitar, singing, horseback riding, riding, running, and playing volleyball. Would you believe that he is more popular popular than the British mo- British monarchy? I don't even know what the British monarchy was. Guess what Chris has included in on his resume? He helped install a robot arm in space. One last fun fact about Chris is that while he was on the ISS, he tweeted about food that we were eating in outer space. Sorry, that he was eating in outer space. This concludes our tour for the day. I hope you enjoyed your time. I learned some new things. Did you? I worked really hard on this project. I really hope you enjoyed your time watching it. As I said before, I learned some things. I hope you did too. And I will see you later, guys. Bye.